St. Lucia receives much-needed oxygen concentrators to aid in the fight against the COVID-19 pandemic. More in this report from Fernel Neptune. The government of the Republic of China, Taiwan, recently handed over 30 oxygen concentrators to the Ministry of Health to support its response to the COVID-19 pandemic. The oxygen concentrators are expected to improve the quality of care provided to patients requiring oxygen. Minister for Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs, the Honorable Moses Jabatis, expressed gratitude to the government of Taiwan for the donation and hopes it will assist in the management of critical COVID-19 patients. The administering of oxygen is a critical component in the management of hospitalized patients. The ministry must ensure adequate supply of oxygen to meet the needs of these hospitalized patients. The Ministry of Health recognizes this donation of oxygen concentrators as another in a series of material, financial, and technical support that the Republic of China and Taiwan is providing to St. Lucia in the fight against the COVID-19 pandemic. Taiwanese ambassador to St. Lucia, His Excellency Peter Chen, says his government remains committed to assisting St. Lucia in the fight against COVID-19 and hopes these oxygen concentrators will save lives. This donation is just one stray of the Taipans binding our countries together. I look forward to working with Prime Minister Fidi Jepier and his cabinet to bring about even more fruitful bilateral cooperation in Fair Helen. As ambassador of Taiwan to St. Lucia, I am filled with pride to see the good acts forged by our good friendship. I hope the machines serve St. Lucians well as they fully recover. Chief Medical Officer Dr. Sharon Belma George says these oxygen concentrators are very essential as they will improve the Ministry of Health's capacity to deliver oxygen to patients needing respiratory support. The sustainable use of oxygen increases greatly during respiratory surges of respiratory illness. And we rely a lot on the use of the oxygen tanks within the hospital. And the turnover increases vastly as our patient load increases as we have been seeing over the last two weeks at our respiratory hospital. So these units allow us supplemental oxygen. They use electricity and they use the oxygen from the air and converts it into oxygen which the patients can use. So it's a lot cheaper, it's a lot easier to make available within the patient rooms or if we have persons who are moderate and also need um, or care for managing at home. The Ministry of External Affairs, International Trade, Civil Aviation and Diaspora Affairs were also thanked for the efforts in making this donation possible. Reporting from the Communications Unit of the Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs, I am Fidel Neptune.